sure there's a wide variety of opinions in the Catholic Church. Um, certainly anyone I've spoken to in the Catholic Church are very supportive of Irish medium education. And the reality is the reason uh, there is a statutory duty in, in relation to Irish medium is because how, of how it has been discriminated against in the past. Now, let's look at some of the myths. Location is the problem. We're not anti-Irish medium. Location is the problem. It is not up with the greatest of respect. It is not up to people in this house to decide where every school goes. Corlian Agail Scoliacta was founded, funded, established. It has worked for years to try and have a good area-based planning. This is part of their area-based planning. I listened to them very carefully when I was in the minister's position, and I have no doubt, I have no doubt that the minister takes their advice uh, with great uh, confidence and looks at the detail in relation to it. We've heard the, the myth, oh, going against advice. And yet, we now know that it's not going against advice. People have written motions that actually are incorrect and rushed them through business committee. Um, the role of CRG... I will take a short one. On Doilac or Dolhan Kinnaton, there are Doskal Shit Bunskal Fubal First, Jenny Dick Shapto Ahean, Bagri O Prison, Ernadine Rinchen. In 1971, when they opened the first Bunskal in Belfast, the uh, promoters were threatened with prison. Uh, do you think perhaps we're making progress today and that, that threat isn't there? I think that illustrates in the past uh, what has happened, but thankfully that isn't happening anymore because Sinn Féin is not going to allow it to happen. Some of the other myths, displacement. You know, we have the ridiculous situation of a member getting up here talking about poor St. Patrick in Mahara. And my colleague Carlo Hoshin has spoken very favourably of St. Pat's, but they have 1,600 pupils. Are we supposed, as the Irish medium sector, the growth of it and development of it supposed to be conditional on not displacing any uh, uh, numbers in English medium sector. That's ridiculous, particularly when you have a situation of demographic decline. We've heard how the numbers have grown in Kalosh the Ferishta from, what was it, 15 to 650. And there, very soon there will not be enough places in that school. It's probably already oversubscribed. We had the ridiculous situation of a member quoting, oh, the children have to travel 20 miles. The, the same member and his party seem to have no problem with children passing each other in the night, going from Downpatrick into grammar schools in Belfast and, and vice versa and right across the north. And £80 million in the past been spent on that. Uh, could I just